What are your, your, your first picture with, with Tay Garnett, uh, Destination Unknown. It's an yeah. interesting picture because you played like a Christ-like figure who comes on the boat. Well, it was a parable on the, the uh, uh, turning the wine into water. Um, it was under dreadful circumstances. The, the Hollywood was in the midst of a flu epidemic, the like of which has never been known, I guess, since the bad one in Chicago, which I went through uh, many years earlier. Um, every studio in town was closed except Universal, where we were making Destination Unknown. And uh, it was a ship, the whole story was, was laid aboard a ship, and finally a wreck, the ship was wrecked, so we'd uh, come to work and uh, climb up on this ship, which was mounted up in the air on, uh, so it could rock and roll uh, as if at sea. And we had, we'd have fire hoses turned on us. It was in the middle of a flu epidemic. And uh, work all day in the water. And uh, I don't know, there's not much, uh, it isn't much of a story except to describe that part of it. We, uh, we ended up in a, a tank uh, we were when we were shipwrecked, and then the final shots uh, down in the ocean, and uh, we all came through it. I must say, uh, I guess in all honesty, uh, during the day, every once in a while, we would nip a little bit. Um, during the shooting of it, um, this was in the days of Uncle Carl Lemley, who ran Universal, and they sent for Tay. Uh, during the daytime one day, and they said, uh, how is it that you can go on making this picture in the midst, midst of this flu epidemic, and with every other studio shut down, and you're the only company working on the lot and all that water? And Tay said, well, we drink a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> you mentioned that he, he had his trademark cane. You called it a goosing cane. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> He was a character. He was a great practical joker, and a great fellow to work with. Always uh, something amusing going on, which um, transmitted itself to the company, and the company was always a happy company. And your other picture with him, uh, Trade Winds. Trade Winds with Freddie March. Yeah. And, and you were, you played just, just just about the whole picture in, in, in front of the process screen with uh, the footage. Uh, Tay was married uh, at that time to uh, Patsy Ruth Miller. And they went around the world on their yacht, their own yacht. And he shot background plates. I don't know if anybody, if everybody understands about background plates. Shall I try to describe what it is? The rear projection. It's a, yeah, uh, a, an enormous um, transparent transparency, maybe uh, 20 feet square. Uh, a camera in back of it um, projected a picture, and the action, uh, the uh, the actors performed in front, so that it looked as if you were in the area that was being projected uh, from the rear of the screen. Is that is that clear enough? And you did the well, whole picture. They, he shot these. Uh, they shot these uh, background plates around the world and uh, then wrote a story about uh, people going around the world. I, I was a crazy detective in that. Freddie March and uh, Johnny Bennett were the uh, romantic interest. You, you did that at the United Artists? Was that at the Wanger? United Artists, yeah. Mm -hmm. Walter Wanger. 